It's Drew here. So, uh, if you are, um, if you've been following my first two videos, uh, I wasn't able to get this uh, Toshiba Porter J Z835 P330 to power on. Uh, so, I actually removed the battery um, just to test it, and then I plugged it in, and it is now functioning. So, apparently, the ba when the battery goes completely bad, or at least in this case, the battery went completely bad, it prevented the computer from shutting turning on itself so now it's just running on power and it is running everything's running the fans running all that so uh, if you're if, you know uh, I don't know how many people own this like I said it's a 2012 um, if you get the little yellow light on the front here where the cord plug is right there uh, let's see if this light is flashing on and off um, when you plug in and you can't get any power it's most likely your battery so it's worth taking the cover off and uh, watch my first two videos, or first video, or first two videos, I guess. Um, and you'll see how you have to have a specific star bit screw to get the cover off, or star bit screw head. And uh, yeah, so there's three videos with this if you're just now catching this. But that did seem to be the issue with my laptop not powering on. A lot of people sell these or throw them out uh, or turn them in. Nope, it was the battery. And you have to take the entire cover off to get to the battery and you have to unscrew the battery so problem solved hope that uh helps hope this helps somebody out if it does please subscribe like this video and comment tell me this helped you um i love doing these videos and i also love knowing it helps people out um probably won't buy another toshiba again this is the ultrabook i was not happy with how customer service worked and how everything else worked um but you know this one lasted four years when i first got it the battery was about eight or 12 hours, believe it or not. But uh, I guess everything deteriorates over time. But that, that one little screw in the center right here, that thing just got on my nerves. I had to go to the store and buy a hardware store, local store, and buy a special screwdriver to get that out, a star bit screwdriver with a hole in the center. So uh, anyway, hey guys, like, subscribe, comment, have a good one, and hope I saved you a couple hundred bucks on going to the computer store. Thanks.